be discussing some of the main mistakes which I made when I started training and even throughout my 20s I continue to make them. Let's go number one. So one of the first mistakes I made, I didn't rotate through the exercises which I was doing. I just stuck to a select few and just kept doing them over and over and over again. Now this isn't always a bad thing, but if you are sometimes doing the same exercises repeatedly, go through the same movement using the same grip, you can actually start to cause injury and irritation, particularly in the shoulders and the elbows. The next mistake I always used to make was I was always so focused on just lifting as heavy as possible and not concentrating on how I was moving the weight from point A to B. Okay, so which muscle I was primarily trying to target. I was literally just trying to focus on moving the weight. I was always focused on just bringing the weight towards me and loading it up as heavy as I possibly could do. But what happened? Over engaging the bicep, hadn't taught myself how to engage the lat. But guess what? My lats never grew. Next mistake I always made, looking at my phone far too much. Now, when I go to the gym, I put my phone on airplane mode or I'm just like a lot more disciplined with myself and I don't look at my phone. You don't have time to check your phone realistically, so if you want a more effective, more focused workout, don't look at your phone. I guess it wasn't really a mistake, but if I'd gone back, I probably would not have done it in the first place, and that is attempting to do far too many one rep maxes. And it was usually the case when I was training with some big guys, I was just letting my ego get in the way and trying to keep up with them. And the majority of the time, I've attempted to do a one rep max. I almost always injured myself. Shoulder problems, lower back problems, every time because of the one rep maxes. Unless you're a power lifter, or you've really got your form on point, your technique is on point, and you can you know, realistically go for it, I just wouldn't bother. Another mistake I used to make, I used to train to failure way too often. And it's not necessary to actually build muscle and to grow. Particularly if you're a beginner, you should not be pushing to failure. There's no need to, you don't need to, to grow. The next mistake I made, not warming up appropriately before my sessions. I remember my early 20s, mid 20s, I used to walk into the gym feeling invincible and literally go straight into my working set weight for the first exercise. Guess what happened? I got myself injured. The priority to warm up adequately before a session is absolutely essential. So I would say for a good five years, particularly the first five years of training, I was following a bro split. Now obviously I saw results from doing this, but was it optimal? Most likely not. It was just not enough stimulus to allow it to grow as much as it possibly could do. And the last one, I used to train far too frequently. Quality over quantity always. When you go to your session, push hard, train effectively, train intense, and you really need to do that four or five times a week to actually see the results which you want to achieve. Okay, so keep that in mind. So there we have it folks, some of the biggest mistakes which I made in my earlier years of training and even throughout my 20s. Everything is good, I'm enjoying life and I'm looking good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you check out the first app if you are in need of any training, programming to maximize hypertrophy and optimize body composition. Don't forget to subscribe to this video and I'll see you in the next one.